you got your first taste of action this season in the under-23s last week. How did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was good. Um, it was nice to get a game. Um, I think it's a cup competition that we want to do well in. I mean, over the last few years, we seem to do really well in it. So um, for it to, to be a, a, a knockout for the first round to go into the group stages, it was important to win and important to get them games for the, uh, the under-23s lockdown this season. And like I say, it's a, it's a big competition for us, which we've done well in over the years. So it's something that this year we're going to want to look to do well in again. And is it exciting because you're coming up against some quite big names as well? Yeah, it is. I mean, you look at, we got, I think, is it Leicester, Norwich and... Nottingham Forest. Is it Leicester, Nottingham Forest and Norwich? Is that right? Yeah. So there's some, there's some big clubs there and it's, it's going to be a good test for us, which is important to, 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 to test ourselves against the best. And um, Sparks, he said it last week, actually. He said, you've got to beat the best to be the best. So only, only Sparks, he would, would come out with something something quite as cliche as that so um but it's true i mean obviously leicester won the premier league a few years ago so they're going to obviously have a great setup great academy nottingham forest have been been known to bring through great young players over the years so like i say it's, it's going to be a good test for us and and it'll be nice to see where we are as a club with our development uh, of course to turn our attention to the check trade trophy against you over on tuesday uh, I guess it could be a chance for lots of players to come in and impress. Yeah, it's it's it's, um, it's it's an opportunity. I mean, it is a first team game at the end of the day, and we've not had a win in three. Um, so it's important that we we try and turn that around. And our next game to do that is obviously tomorrow against Yeovil. So it's 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 obviously getting treated like a, a, a an important first team game, and we want to want to stop the um, stop the the um, the losses if you like, and, and turn it around with a win. And it is a trip to Hewish Park, which in recent seasons has been a tough place to go for City. Are the boys looking forward to the match? Yeah, I think so. Um, I think there's going to be a uh, freshness about us, and um, it's just something that we 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 need to we need to win this game. We need to win. I mean, like I say, we, we've come off the back with three losses, so it's one that we need to turn around. And as you say, our record at, at, at Yeovil's not been great, so why not turn that around tomorrow? I suppose um, if you can go and win that game as well, put you in a really strong position considering. West Ham and Bristol Rovers to come at St James Park. Yeah, it does. I mean, for it to be our only away game, um, I think it is important um, to, to to get points on the board. Um, and then, if we do that, we've got um, exciting games at St James's Park ahead. Mm -hmm.